24 year old male uh, to rule out internal uh, derangement of the knee sagittal pd fat sat images starting from the uh, medial aspect going towards the lateral side the anterior horn and the posterior horn of the uh, medial meniscus appears relatively preserved just in the periphery of the uh, um, posterior horn there's a little bit of high signal intensity but no obvious uh, signal changes extending to either of the articular surface there appears to be extensive bone marrow edema involving the medial femoral condyle and epicondyle also extending posteriorly towards the intercondylar region and cranially in the metadiaphysis the ACL fibers appear parallel uh, to the posterior femoral margin and parallel to the Blumensat line but there is intrinsic high signal intensity within the ACL suggestive of partial thickness tear the posterior cruciate ligament appears intact as we go further on to the lateral meniscus the lateral meniscus appears to be intact with maybe a thin uh, tear vertical tear extending to the uh, superior articular surface of the posterior horn the quadriceps tendon appears intact the petalar tendon is intact let's have a look at the coronal PD fat saturated images again here we can identify the medial collateral ligament appears intact so does the lateral collateral ligament the articular margins look all right the cartilage appears to be preserved Let's have a look at the petalofemoral femoral joint and the axial PD fat sat images. The articular margins of the petalofemoral femoral joint also looks fairly preserved. So yeah, this is a case of uh, partial thickness ACL tear with mild effusion and contusion of the distal femur.